Learn the symptoms of a bad knock sensor. The purpose of the knock sensor is to send the signal to the ECM when it senses unwanted vibrations in the engine. For example, if there's an engine knock, which basically means there's an extra mini detonation after the spark plug ignites, the knock sensor will read this vibration, create an AC voltage and send it to the ECM. Then the ECM will try to prevent this from happening again, by retarding the ignition timing or in other words changing when the spark plug ignites the air fuel mixture. This helps prevent serious damage to your engine. Now some cars have more than one knock sensor, and the location varies from car to car. I've seen it underneath the intake manifold, and in other situations on the lower side of the engine right above the starter. The first symptom of a bad knock sensor is having your check engine light on. If the ECM senses something wrong with the knock sensor these codes may pop up. To be able to scan for codes you'll need an OBD2 scanner. I'll leave the one that I use, and works for me, in the description below. The second symptom is poor performance. You'll feel a lack of acceleration, your vehicle will overall be slower. A bad knock sensor reading can trick the ECM to believe that there's a detonation leading to the ECM changing the ignition timing when it's not needed. This causes poor combustion efficiency. In some situations the ECM can purposely limit you to a certain speed to protect your vehicle if it senses the knock sensor is dysfunctional. The third symptom is poor fuel economy. Leading back to the previous example, since the combustion efficiency decreases when the ECM changes the ignition timing, this will result in poor gas mileage. The fourth symptom is a knocking noise. Some people describe it as metallic noise when the engine is running. Since the purpose of the knock sensors is to detect unwanted detonations and relay this information to the ECM to change the ignition timing to fix the issue. If the sensor is failing, the ECM won't be able to know exactly when to change the ignition timing results in there to be unwanted detonations in the combustion process. Now before concluding you have a bad knock sensor always make sure to look for torn wiring or corrosion on the connectors as these can cause similar symptoms. Now if you guys are experiencing other symptoms make sure to check out our other how to videos. I hope you enjoyed this video, do not forget to like this video, and be sure to comment, share and subscribe. Thank you.